Welcome to some of Awesome Games. Good looking people, my name is Rob. We are playing Hitman 3 on top of the world. Now, we're going from the start. This is the first level, so I'm going to treat you like a little baby as we do this guide. We're going to do Icarus. We're going to make Marcus fly too close to the sun and then die, okay? So if you have, like, the crew member starting point and stuff, you can jump ahead to towards the end of this. But, if not... Follow along with me, we're going to get a little outfit here so we can go backstage and get a happy chappy little fuse box which we need to power the sun. Once we power the sun, we can switch it on and then blow it up. So we're going to take this guy's outfit, his little pain, if you've got coins and stuff, it's much easier. But this is a good save point for working on your masteries. Once you get this guy's outfit, he's the, I think, probably the best guy to get to begin with. Knock him out, take his disguise, and then put him in the closet uh, just around the corner here. And then you're happy. Make a little save point there, and you're pretty much well set for uh, unlocking your masteries and then unlocking new starting points and stuff, and then you can go from there. But to begin with, this is it. This is step one. So, if you're now with me again, or have been with me the entire time, we're going to continue on from here in our new digs. And run down here, open this way. What we're gonna get is the fuse box. So if you are the crew member, you would come in here and come up these stairs, just like we are now. We're gonna grab a crowbar, which is conveniently in this area as well, just here. Da 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 da. We pick that up. Don't worry about these people, they are blind and we are shielded by a wall. Bust this open, grab a fuse cell, and that is more or less everything we have to do to warm up with this. Now you can go straight to the fuse box and just wait. Uh, otherwise, you can follow Marcus around and learn all different things and create multiple saves for other things you might be working on. But uh, that's that's the start. Donezo. So if you do follow Marcus around, he walks around, talks about wine and stuff or whiskey. Uh, we will do guides for them. Otherwise, you'll end up back here, which is the hallway we ran down after getting our outfit. And he'll start going to look at the sun exhibit. So, we follow him down here, casually, chillfully. Feel free to speed this up. I don't mind. I, I'm just trying to show up for uh, the slower people out there. I know you might be a genius, be like, oh, you have to show all of this. Yes, some people aren't as smart as you. All right, you gotta, you gotta really hold their hand. So we're gonna chat. So where we're gonna go is, is where I was just looking. We're gonna go down there. This is a fuse box. You see that white thing? So we, we took a fuse from breaking into something similar. And then you can put the fuse into a box like that. But not that one! Oh no, not that one. That one... I actually don't know what the hell that powers, if anything. It's a bit... it's just there. I guess it's there to throw you off. So you don't want to put your fuse in here. Because that would be stupid. Run or down here. So we've, we're literally to the left. I know it's a little bit of a jump, but we're literally to the left of that fuse box. And down here... Is the switch, but that's not the fuse box. What, what? We have this ladder. Climb up this ladder, you'll find the fuse box, which will make the safety power switch go beyond its safe levels. What, what? Put it in there. Ta-da. We're all good to go. This is where patience pays off. So you could have gone here straight away. You literally could have grabbed the fuse, run back down the ramp that we came up to get the fuse, ran all the way down here, put it in, and then stood here for like five minutes or more and waited for Marcus to do his loop and come back. If you start as the crew member, I'm pretty sure you can knock this out very quickly, but uh, that's up to you, you do that. And there he is, we wait, we wait patiently. You don't wanna do it now. He's gotta go stand in the water, what, why? Put big electronics in water, Perfect. safety. Uh, and then we exceed the safety limit and that's it. You're done, Zoe. Good job. Icarus. Now you can jump back to all the saves that you made on your journey around and finish off other challenges, which I also have guides for, so you can jump to them. I'm sure that'll be at the end of this video if you're looking for specific things. But thank you for watching. I hope this helped. I don't see how it wouldn't, because that's how you do it.